Hey, what is going on everyone? Sabretooth here and today guys I have an amazing video for you on how you guys can make hundreds of thousands of coins really easily And all you have to do is open packs Guys if you are new to the channel make sure to hit that subscribe button and smash that like button guys Let's get right into the video So as you can see I have six ten trophy packs saved up as well as some of these x-factor packs now x-factor live events did just come into the game a little while ago and I just wanted to see if we could pull anything from these. They don't really have anything to do with the coin making, but I just kind of wanted to see what we can do with them. So let's get right into that. So starting with the first X Factor pack, guys, these really have nothing to do with the coin making method. But so there's a silver trophy. The only reason why I'm opening these is because they give you trophies and trophies are a big part of the reason why right now I think is the best time to ever pull packs save from the very first day of madden which is when packs are really really valuable so it looks like we're getting silver trophies every single time i don't know if you can get bronzes every single time it's a silver trophy so that's not too bad honestly so every silver trophy is worth about a thousand coins so if you play this live event every time you play it, it's about a thousand coins so that's not too bad too bad we couldn't get anything better though every single one is silver i don't know you guys let me know if you've gotten anything else. So, looks like 9 silver trophies. So, that's 9,000 coins right there. And now we have these 10 trophy packs, guys. So, the reason why these are so valuable right now. I made a video a little while ago on it. And it's done really well. And it was a great method for me. But, guys, the reason is right now, if you look in the sets. And these team MVPs, they require trophies. Now, trophies have gone way up in price because of that. So, you need 3 elite trophies and 5 gold trophies. Gold trophies, let's go check their price right now. We'll do a little bit of math so you guys can definitely see why this really does work. So let's take a look at the gold trophies. Head over to the program trophies. All these will go for 6,000 coins, guys. Hands down, you wait an hour, they sell for 6,000. Every single one of these is going to sell if you wait an hour. You can post it for 5,500 if you want to be a little quicker. But 6,000 coins, keep that in mind for every gold trophy. Now every elite trophy, and those used to go for about 4,000 coins. Now, every Elite Trophy as well goes for 30000 guys. If you have not checked their price recently, they used to go for 18000 Now, they go for 30000 29999 Whatever it is, it will sell for that, guys. You can see none of these have been up for more than an hour. So, Elite Trophies go for 30000 and then Silvers and Bronzes are about the same. So, let's go and hop into the, some of these packs. Before we do that, let's check out the set, though. So the set that I do use a ton is the gold player trade-in. Now, gold players have gone up in price, but the reason for that is because you also need gold players to do the MVP set. As you can see, I have a ton. Just these are for another method that if you guys want to see, it's kind of outdated now, now that there's this whole team MVP thing going on. But if you want to add in 10 gold players, gold players now, you can go and snipe them. They're getting tough, though, to snipe for 2,500. Even that, so if you do actually want to snipe gold players to just throw in the set and make these, see if you can get some luck like mine. What I like to do is just go 79 overall as your max, and then the price, I'll put 2,500, and here I'll put 2,001, because those 2,000s sell really, really quickly. Let's go 75 here. So the 2,000s sell really quickly, but these ones that are a little bit over 2,000, they're still good prices, but they don't sell as quick. And then obviously what you want to do, maybe the round just dropped. I guess it actually just dropped. So I'm a little late. Let's see what we can get though. So what I like to do is go all the way to the back and see if there's anything left over at the end, especially since the round. Yeah, so the round had already dropped, but pretty much you want to just go to the back if you actually want to pick them up that way. But I'm going to be telling you guys how you can do this using only packs. So let's go to my team and open up these trophy packs first. And then I'm going to tell you how you get the gold players by only opening packs. Keep in mind, it does actually involve pro packs. And pro packs, they're a dual threat now. Now that elites have gone up, the pack odds have been raised, and these gold player trophies, gold player prices have gone up. So there's an elite there, guys. Two elites. So each of these elites is worth 30,000 coins, and the gold is 6,000 coins. The silvers are about one, so that's 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000. That is 10,000. So that's 70,000 in one pack, guys. Let's keep moving on. I just want to tell you guys, this is a crazy method. Even if these gold players are tough to snipe, you can get them from packs. You can get them. So no elites here, but let's count up our money. 6,000, 12,000, 18,000, 
24,000, so 30,000, and so about 33,000 from that pack. So if you snipe these players for 25,000 each, put them into the set, you would have made 8,000 off of that pack that didn't even have an elite trophy. If you get an elite trophy, you're automatically, everything else is profit. So let's see what we can get here. Start with a gold, silvers, silver, 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 and no elites there. So this is a really bad pack, but the profit we made from that first pack makes up for this. So that's 8,000, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, and 14,000. So we actually lost, if you think about the sniping prices, about 9,000 on that pack. But we made more than 9,000 off that first one, so it should be okay. So there's an elite there, guys. Two elites again, and a gold and a silver. So that's 8,000, 9,000, that's 15,000, that's 45,000, 75,000, about 76,000 from that pack, guys. And if you guys are not convinced by now, I don't know what else can you co convince you. Not only did they raise the pack odds, guys, seems like you can pull elites pretty easily from these. No elites there, but take a look at that. So that's 24,000. That's 36,000, 38, 39, 40,000 coins off that pack. It's a crazy method. If you guys are only interested in opening packs, just throw all the stuff you get from pro packs. There's an elite, guys. So that's 12,000, 18, 24, 30,000 coins, 36,000 coins, 66,000 coins off that one pack, guys. I think we maybe just made almost 200,000 live off of those packs. Now let's jump into the store, open up, I don't know, 20 pro packs, see what we can get, throw them into the set again, and just repeat the process, guys. You don't even need to go onto the auction market to do this. That's what's so crazy. So John Sullivan, 82 overall center, decent pull there, over 80. You could sell them off individually if you wanted and buy a cheaper gold, but for the purpose of the video, we'll just toss them in there. So Robert Mathis, 77 linebacker, guys. This method is crazy. So, Janoris Jenkins, 82 corner. Obviously, the pack odds clearly have been raised, guys. I've been getting a lot of comments saying, there's Patrick Robinson, that they've been having a lot more luck pulling elites, and I have two, guys. I've pulled, I don't know how many elites. So, there's a Tyler Lockett wide receiver. That's a really nice pull. I won't put him in the set because Seahawks players are actually worth, as I talked about earlier, there's another John Sullivan. Every Seahawks gold player is worth something like 10,000 coins at least. So honestly, I can sell them off individually and make even more money off that pack. Blake Bortles, nothing too good. Can we get an elite though? Le'Veon Bell! Oh my goodness, guys. Sorry if I broke your headphones, broke your eardrums. But we just pulled Le'Veon Bell out of a pro pack, guys. This opening is crazy. Not only did we make, I don't even know, 200,000 coins off of the trophies. But guys, we're pulling elites. Deshaun Jackson, once we're done... I think we've maybe spent, I don't know, 80,000 coins. I think we were close to 500 when I started. So Jimmy Smith there, guys. I don't know. I've spent about, I want to say 10 pro packs so far. So there's another Deshaun Jackson. So we got two repeats so far, John Sullivan and Deshaun Jackson. So interesting luck there. Trumaine Johnson this time. Nothing too good. Still calming down after that Le'Veon Bell pull. And we get a Kendall Wright. Not a good pull there. But I think he does go into the Titans set, which gets you DeMarco Murray. So I'm just going to throw him in the trophy set, though. Russell Okung, not a good pull there. Packs have kind of cooled down a bit, but we can get another good pull. Light him right back up. We get a Kyle Juszczyk, Headliners Edition. His price is really low, though. I don't know why. He's an 82 fullback. but So another Russell Okung, guys. So that's our third duplicate of this pack opening. Let's just go down to about 300,000 coins. Toss them in. We'll say we'll stop it after spending 200,000 coins on these pro packs and then see how much money we can make back. See how much that Le'Veon goes for and total up all our profit from this episode, guys. So, guys, if you are new to the channel, consider subscribing, guys, because I make videos like this all the time, guys. I feel like this method is crazy and you don't really have to compete with some of those bot snipers who just use these I don't know, automated sniping things. I don't really know how to use them. Mario Edison and a game plan collectible. Because Android, I don't think you can have a bot. But pretty much all these gold players right now are getting sniped really quickly. But if you just pull these pro packs, guys, especially with boosted odds, you will get some good stuff. So Trey Boston there. So we're winding down. Only a couple more packs to go. My bench is full. How is that possible? 
All right, guys, I'll get back to you after I clear up some space. I've never had this happen ever so far in Bad Mobile this year. So I'll clear this up and get back to you guys in a little bit. Okay, guys, so I cut our items down a bit. We're down to 1,051 out of 1,200. So let's open up maybe three more packs. We still have that one saved up because when we overflowed, it just got saved to my my pack section. We'll finish these up. Jordan Berry, guys. This pack opening just gets even better. I'll go show you guys his price afterward. He sells for a lot of coins. That's an amazing pull there, guys. I don't know how many coins we've made off this pack. Another Kevin White. So that is four sets of duplicates we've got in this pack opening. Maybe the duplicates are good pack luck. I don't know. Eric Armstead, our last one, is going to be... Maybe this was supposed to be... Yeah, actually, the last one was supposed to be the last one. But we ended off with a Marcus Peters. Let's go back, open that other one in the that I have saved up, and finish off this episode with our final rounds of profit. So let's go ahead, pro pack here. Last pro pack, and then we'll go make some sets and get some more profit. So we end off with an Eric Reed. So guys, here is our final total of players, I guess. We'll go look up that uh, Le'Veon Bell, and we'll go search him up right now. So Bell... 89 overall let's go take a look at his price i'm hoping for 70,000 coins maybe his price has dropped so he is actually still over 70,000 coins let's take a look at 90,000 coins guys i'm telling you these pro packs are juiced right now i'm loving the pack odds by ea i'm so glad they introduced just sort of boosted them and it actually worked out so let's sell them off right now for 78,999 so that's 78,000 off of our what 200,000 pack opening for 300 200,000 pack opening so that's already 78,000 back on that now our Jordan Berry this is the other guy I did not want to toss into that set I'm not going to toss any of the kind of higher overall ones let's look at his 81 card and let's just go 60,000 coins see what it's going for so there's one that got sold for 50,000 coins so these all go for about 50,000 there's a snipe for 4,000 so 50,000 coins just off of a gold punter guys if you ever pull him make sure to not sell him with the other ones just like that guy did for 4000 Because he goes for 45000 So off of those two players, we've already made back 130000 of it. Now let's look up the Tyler Lockett. And 78. Let's take a look at under 10,000 coins. So his wide receiver card does sell for 10000 Look at all those getting sold right away for 10,000 coins so that's another 10,000 added on to our total so we are sitting at let's just put it up for 11,999 see if anybody buys this so we've already made back almost our entire pack opening and we haven't even done the trophy set yet guys that's what's so crazy about this method not only does everybody love pulling packs and having the chance to pull something crazy but you're not gonna lose pretty much any of your money and I haven't even gone over the silver players Toss those into the silver trophy. Do whatever you want with them. I'm just keeping that Urlacher just because for good time's sake. I don't even know why. Let's toss this in here. So Kendall Wright claimed this reward. 10 trophy pack. This might be the final one. I don't know if I should toss in those higher overall ones. So two silvers there. We get a gold and elite guys. So all the rest of this is profit automatically. Another silver. So that's 30. 42,000, 43,000, 44, 45, 46. So that's a, about a 47,000 pack there. Let's do one more. These packs are absolute fire right now, guys. I can't believe that this method works so well. It's crazy. Let's finish it off with this 10 trophy pack, guys. If you have enjoyed this, make sure to hit a like. Another elite trophy, another elite trophy, guys. This is maybe one of my best pack openings I had in a long time. This is looking about 60,000, 72,000. A set about an 80,000 gold trophy pack to end it off guys there's no better way to end the episode guys if you have enjoyed the video make sure to subscribe hit that like button share this video guys this is a crazy method and I hope you guys really do enjoy it I have another sniping filter probably one of the best ones I've ever created coming soon so if you guys are excited make sure to comment down below like the video guys snipe these gold players buy some pro packs toss them in the sets make coins Break some ankles, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.